Hi, this is Aoud USD and today it's Monday 26th of January 2015 and the time is 16.31 GMT. I'm Sofia Stavropoulou and this is a video signal for Forex ID Academy members, FX colleagues, Forex Signals apps users and WhatsApp Signal subscribers. I'm using Ichimoku Kinko Kinkohio, Bollinger Bands, Fractals and Stochastics. This is the H4 time frame of Aud USD <coughs> and we see that the, the pair is, is making a corrective and upward corrective move. Uh, the stochastics made a strong bullish crossover and they go wildly upwards. Uh, now, you have two options. You either wait to see which will be the price interaction with the medium Bollinger Band in order to decide if you will enter long from there and buy or if you will enter short and ride the downtrend or you will enter long, you will buy as soon as the bullish crossover uh, of the price of the of the Tenkan Sen, the red line of Ichimoku Kinko Hill is validated. It will be valid if uh, Tenkan Sen becomes curved or angled or slop, uh, sloping upwards. Uh, for now it is going down so we wait. So if you buy when price t when uh, Tenkan Sen becomes curved upwards, uh, place your stop loss <coughs> a few pips below the uh, below Tenkan Sen because um, I see stochastics with a very aggressive uh, in a very aggressive mood, so. I don't think you should take this high risk to place it down here to this fractal. Maybe placing your stop loss at the price level of this candlestick here below the spike of this candlestick here at 0 0.7884 would be okay. Placing your take profit target at 0 0.7995. Uh, at the price level of the median Bolger band if you buy and you will buy only at the condition that Tenkan Sen is curved upwards otherwise stay, uh, stay out. Now if you decide to wait and if everything uh, looks uh, bearish after the price approaches the medium Bollinger Band makes a swing high above it and starts falling again only on that condition uh, you have two options. You either enter after a bearish candlestick closes below, tenkans, below the medium Bollinger Band or you wait for uh, a bearish candlestick to close below Tenkan Sen with Tenkan Sen curved downwards. In that case you sell, you place your stop loss above Kids, where Kidzen Sen is now and uh, because the take profit target can be placed due to the uh, wide bearish momentum of the pair, uh, staying uh, while the candlesticks on H4 close below Tenkan Sen and exit with the bullish crossover of the stochastics. This is the uh, bearish, the short entry, the sell entry scenario. I repeat, buy if Tenkan Sen becomes curved upwards place your stop loss at 0 0.7884, your take profit target at the price level of the medium Bollinger Band at 0 0.7991 and uh, if when the price reaches that, that level um, looks like it wants to, to, to continue its fall and that the correction is over, then sell uh, either below uh, the medium Bolzer band or when a bearish price Tenkan Sen cross happens, placing your stop loss above the Kidzen Sen and staying in while the candlesticks close below Tenkan Sen and exit on a bullish crossover of the stochastics. Thanks for watching and happy pips.